Hello everyone. I hope you must be very fine, very healthy. This is Priyanka Vasti. Welcome back to your own channel, Maths and Minutes. In today's video, we are going to learn about set. Now, what is set? Set is basically a well-defined collection of some elements, right? Now, what is the meaning of this word "well-defined"? Things. Whenever we have some distinct things, right? If we talk about the days in a week, then we have Monday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Right? Now the distinct elements. This is called a well-defined. Now, if I talk about, find out the tall trees in your area. So, tall is a relative term. That means it is different for me and. Uh, tall perception is different from some other person it differs individual to individual now if i have a collection of good students in a class so good can be different from me good can be different from some other person right so these are not well defined what is well defined it is a distinct object right if i talk about the states in india so we all know there are 29 states in india and we can name all those things it comes under the category of well defined or it is a set right a ways to represent the set first one is the description method as the name indicates what is description description means to describe suppose if i am talking about the vowels in the alphabet then we will have to put the curly braces curly braces are very important to represent any set now description is we will simply write vowels in a alphabet right now this is called description set use words to describe some sets is called description form the description we have the roster form now what is this roster form Ro in roster form we represent the elements right now i talk about the natural numbers less than 10 right so what is the answer First of all, it is should be in the curly braces. Suppose this is a set A and the name of the set has to be in the capital letter. Now, natural numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Right. So, th so this is a roster form and these are called the elements. Right. And elements are always represented by comma now if i talk about the word mathematics right so and this we have to represent in the roster form then in roster form we will write m a t h e m a t i c s right this is a very common method to write in the roster form but here i would like to make it very clear we do not write the repeated words for example here m is repeated here a is repeated t is repeated so we will not write those we will write the elements only and only once that means m will come a will come t will come h will come e will come then i will come c will come and s will come right we will not write the repeated ones same way if we have to write the set builder form we can also say set builder form includes the condition how let's see let us name it as a right now if question we have to write in the set builder form then what we write we put a curly braces we write x right each element we are indicating as x x such that x now line is read as such that x such that x is a natural number right and comma x is less than 10 this is the set builder form right mathematics question if i have to write the set builder form let it be any set suppose this is set b same method x such that x now what it is letters in mathematics right suppose we have the set a in the roster form and we have to write the set builder form then how we used to write it set is written a then all the elements are x so x such that x now we have to see 
what it is following right it is 10 11 12 13 14 that means it's a simple natural number then x belongs to natural number and what is the condition the starting from 10 ending till 16 so this is a condition greater than equals to 10 and less than equals to 16 so it's very simple to write the set builder form or the rule method from the roster form now if we have the set builder form such that x such that x is a month right which x is less than 30 days so we will write the roster form and since we know only we have one month has less than 30 days and that is february so we, our answer will be february these so, are the ways in which we represent the sets in the coming videos we will be learning about the types of cells their operations when diagrams and so on so please keep watching the videos and press the bell icon to get my latest update and not to miss any video related to the sets thank you so much for watching my video